look like a chicken. Cock a doo doo doo. That's it. Cock a doo doo doo. Welcome or welcome back to my channel, All Things Misha. My name is Tamisha. So as you can see, this is a different type of video. I have my bonnet on. So I'll be reviewing two wigs from Timu and I'm gonna put the name and the price across the screen. I'm also gonna put the link in the description box if it's something that you're interested in purchasing. And also, I um, if you have you ever ordered a wig from Timu or are you considering ordering a wig from Timu? And if this video is something that you're interested in seeing, Keep on watching. Hey okay, you guys, so let's get started. This is my bag with my two wigs in there. I'm going to take this bonnet off and I already have a, um, already have a HG cap under my wig and the HG caps are bomb. I just wanted to say that, but I'm going to get my thing I used to put on my wigs and my powder if I can. I have this, I use this Morphe powder thing that I have. I had for a long time. I need to get a new one. But um, yeah, so what I'm going to do is, well, I don't have to do it for this one yet because this is a, the shorter one I got. Okay, before I put this wig on, I got to I gotta say something. So I'm going I'm to insert clips of what I'm talking about, but it's this style that I want to try um, I wanted to try it back in 2014 because I'm going to show you a picture of when I cut my hair in 2014 by a professional. Um, and I liked it. I did, but I was starting to miss my, cause that, that wasn't wearing wigs back then. I was starting to miss my, um, my sewings. So, but I had my hair cut probably like throughout my whole pregnancy and no, not half of my pregnancy in 2014. And then, um, I ended up cutting my own hair just I don't know what happened. I was just sitting home one day after work and I went in the bathroom and I just cut my hair with some scissors. So my hair was real, real short. And that was cute on me too, but I never really wore it out because that during that time I was wearing wigs. So I slapped a wig on my head. But this particular style, like, and I kind of wanted it since back then. I don't know if I can find the picture because it was, um, was it Adele? Was it Adele? It was somebody. I think it was a style that Adele had back then. Because I think I, 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 I stumbled across it not too long ago. But anyway, it was this style I wanted back in 2014. I kind of cut my hair like that, but not really. And then this style I'm talking about now, why I purchased this wig, it's the kind like, it's like real little spirals. It's real cute. I'm going to insert a picture of what I'm talking about. But I want to try that style so bad. But then sometimes I'll be like, my face is round and I have you know big cheeks and stuff so i don't know how to look on me but i got this wig as you can see it's a short wig i'm taking this out but it's a real short wig like it's short and the neck came on it so let me see is the right side okay yeah so let's see baby <laughs> girl somebody i feel like somebody out there somewhere probably hold on i'm trying to see am i doing it right is it right or hold up i think i i think yeah yeah good child i don't know what i'm doing y'all i really don't but i'm trying to see a little something something I'm trying to make something shake make something work Y'all, what, what is this? What happened? I feel like, I don't know what I feel like. <laughs> Cause I'm trying to cover my naps in the back, baby, because it's, it's real nappy back there. But, cause see, this is a little parting on the side of on it. I feel, I feel like I could do something if I knew, oh, <laughs> a little too rough, girl, a little too rough, but 
this is that first. So I feel like somebody who really can do or like know what to do with short hair because I never really had short hair like that. And if I did, it was a short period of time, like I said, in 2014, I feel like somebody would know how to make this work. I'm going to insert the picture. Oh. I'm going to insert the picture of how it looked online. And yeah. But I feel like it could work. Like, I feel like someone could make this work. Someone can make this work. Someone know what they're doing and they can jazz this up and make it work. But it's not, it's not too terrible now. It's not too terrible. Like if you know how to work that curling iron or flat iron or however they be curling short hair um, or real small, I don't know. But I feel like this could, this could be something if I just knew the direction that it needed to go. You know, you know what I mean? You know, know what I'm saying? I think it could possibly do a little something, something. What do y'all think? Comment down below and let me know what you think. Right now, I look like a chicken. cock a doo doo That's it. cock a doo 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 But I feel like it could, like, I just have to know what direction I'm trying to go. And it can work. Yeah. But this is the first one. Real short. I can't remember how this, it was cheap though. Real short, you know. I'm gonna get myself in the mirror. <laughs> but yeah, I really, I, I think, I think it has potential, honestly, because I didn't see some people turn some things into magic. Okay, so if you are the right person, like you know how to like tweak short hair and know how to do it, I think this wig will um come out good. Honestly, it's just me personally. I don't know what I'm doing, but yeah, but I think it has potential. I really think it has potential. And for the price, I mean, come on, you can do an experiment. But yeah, this is the first one. I think this is the better part. <laughs> cheese but yeah this is the first one though you guys can comment down below and let me know if you think you can work this because i think it can be worked you just have to be the right type of person to work it and i don't, I don't know if i want to turn around because these naps back here mm -hmm. but this is not looking back but i really feel like you can like possibly curl it up and stuff but yeah yeah Girl. Let's move on to the second one. But this is the first one. Let's go on to the second one. Let me take this off. Okay. This is the second one. The second one is longer. Um the second one is longer. This is the second one. I'm have to, oh, no. Came with a net. That net already came off with the bag in the inside. And this is the second one. It's just a straight. I'm going to plug my curling iron up, honestly, to see. Oh, not my curl. Well, no, I'm going to see if it can curl. Yeah, but I'll probably end up straightening this, though. I'll probably get my flat iron out in a second. But this is the second one. And the inside of the second one, look at the inside. I thought it was a full lace. Sometimes I don't, I mean, I have really read this description. I don't know. But this is how it looks in the front. I don't know if y'all can see. You see how that look? And it's like a little bit of um space if you wanted to like pluck the lace a little bit. And it's almost like this little T-zone down, uh, well, no, T-part, sorry, down the middle here. Um, Because I was going to bleach the lace and you know kind of see how that works but i didn't because these knots are pretty dark but i'm gonna just see i'm gonna just put some powder in there because like i said it's just a little tea part so it's really no need to well well no it is like little lace a little lace like through the little track area but it's not like you know how full lace thing or whatever but um 
I might end up bleaching it later and I might mention it in a vlog or something. But for right now, I just want to show you guys how it is straight out the pack. If you need to just throw it on and go oh, real quick. Um, but yeah, so let me take I'm gonna take this one off in a second, but I'm gonna see. Mm. Cause I wanted to try to see if I can pluck it a little bit. Let me see, cause I have my tweezers right here. I don't even need to um, show y'all cause baby, I don't really know how to pluck a thing. Okay. I do what I do. This is not working. I usually put it on my way here. Hold on. I'm going to be back in a second because I got to do that. But this is it. Give me a second. I'll be back. So as you can see, close up how the hairline looks. It's real thick. I'm going to try to do a little something, baby, because I, I am not an expert. I try to do what I can do when I do it. But I'm a part of here. And I'm not sure if you guys can hear that wind because that wind is really having its way outside. So I'm going to try to do a little plucking. I know some people pluck wet. Like I said, I'm not a professional. I just do something. And then plus this lace, I have, this is my first time working with a lace that look like this. So that's another, oh no, I don't think I want to do this because it almost looked like I'm going to end up Possibly putting a hole in it. Oh, maybe I'm just too rough. I, I'm not going to do it. I'm just going to leave it how it is. Put um, powder in the part and then put it on. And also, I didn't show you guys the inside. It has the um, the little band things in the back. And I usually always put, well, depending on your head size, how you maneuver this. But I normally, um, I always put it on the last one. The last one or the second to the last one. And it kind of like crisscross. And sometimes it'll have it a little bunchy in the back, but that's that don't bother me. So let me take this one off. Ooh, that thing's a little hot. Mm. Oh, probably because I'm doing all this stuff, I'm getting hot. But I'm gonna put this one on. Oh, I forgot to put the powder in here. I forgot to put the powder in here. And put the powder on my cap. So, oh, as you can see, I'm doing that here. So let me do that. And also, um, it might not be too bad. I don't know. I plugged up my flat iron and my um my hot comb. Cause I always say, baby, if you wear a wig. You definitely, definitely need to invest in a hot comb because that's the only way that your wig is going to be flat. Like, yes, sometimes you can do the, um, you can do like, uh, like either sometimes like your flat iron, the bottom, like, you know, how, how hot sometimes a flat iron can get. And then you can like on the outside, close it and then like press down on it or like a curling iron, you know, the barrel how hot it is and kind of like press down and like that. But for me, I think the best result is, that's all I'm doing. The best result is a, um, a hot comb. And let me tell you, this week it's snug. And I love my wigs to be like really snugged. So I put it on and see what that powder in there, that part looks good. Like I don't even have to, uh, Put no, um, I didn't have to bleach it. So let me see what it'll do with, and I'm looking, so like I said, I'm looking at my, my mirror straight ahead of me. Um, let me see if I can cut this lace. Cause I usually cut lace off. Like not on my head type of thing. So let me see if I can do this. Because baby, I've never really done it before. You know what? No. I'm going to take this wig off. And hold on. 
I forgot to have this. Let me see if I can use this archer to do it. Let me get in this mirror. Okay, I'm back. So as you can see, I did cut the lace. And like I said, you could possibly try to um, do something with the, the, like the plucking and stuff. But I really don't think so. I think this wig could be good. You know how you just have a bone straight type of look. I think that's what this wig will give. I'm going to try to like, you know, flatten the top and stuff. But I'm always feeling like Morticia. Mm -hmm. Family matters. Not... <laughs> Not family matters. Um, oh, my, Adam's family. Yeah, Adam's family vibes. But let me get, let me see how this hot cone works. Let's see. And I, like I said, I usually, I'm doing this stuff for camera, but I usually do everything on my wig head. Then I put it on my head. But for the video purposes, I'm going to try to do it on my head. Because maybe sometimes I, um... Let me see. Because one thing I can say, this hair is that, um, that, like, shiny type feel. I mean, the body is body and don't get me wrong. But that, that sheen, it's, 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 it's a, I mean, I can't describe the feeling, but it's a little feeling. But for the price, you know, it'll do. And that's all that matters sometimes. Like, you know, you, if you want to wear your wig for a little second for some little event or, you know, whatever, this wig is good. And I'm trying to see if it's going to burn. I know it's hot. I know that. For a fact, that it's hot. Flat iron is on two ninety five, but as you can see, it's straightening it though. Hmm. And usually when I flat iron my hair, I have this gadget. It's like a clamper. You put it on, you hold it. But that's usually when I when I'm working on my mannequin head. I never really done it using it on my head. It's usually when I have it on my mannequin head, but. As you can see, it is definitely, definitely straightening and getting bone straight. So that's a plus. Um, and like I said, the, the I look at it and doing this now, like I think it's worth, uh, and see how it's worth the price for, you know, something quick, but how you close the flat iron. And if you want to press down on your hair, you can use your flat iron as well to, you know, flatten your hair and hold it down and all that stuff. But yeah, for the most part, I, I like this. And I don't know how coloring go. I mean, it might be fine because I was um, going through the file. See, it's like it's fine, but, but you know what, sometimes when your your wig might be like lumpy or something sometimes it's your foundation because right here i kind of feel my braid so that could be the reason why that's not flattening out all the way that i would like it to do so all i do is just keep working with that and you know trying to hold it down but oh <laughs> sorry but for the most part i like this i really do like I, and I said, it's worth it for the price. And I cannot remember the inch. So I had to put that across the screen. I cannot remember the inch. And let me see, is this it right here? It is, no, oh, 16. This is 16 inches. But, you guys, I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna lie. Like, if I really take my time, and go through this and straighten it. This is a cute little bob here. You know, and if you want to 
you know, put it behind your ear, the little ear motion. You can do that. But I'm not mad at this, y'all. Like, I'm really trying to look and see and all that stuff. I think this is pretty decent. This is pretty decent. Like I said, for the price and for something real quick. Yeah, this is it. Because I'm going to put a picture of how it look on the... um have a look on online but let me um let me try to flat iron it some more at the top and come back and then when i come back i'm gonna try to like curl the front for you guys just to see how it curls but for the most part i love it and it's dark because this is not that because i know like when i get with it's like a, a brownish color to me this is more black and I know some people like that all black hair, but for what it's worth, I love it. But like I said, let me go and try to straighten it some more. I mean, not straighten some more, like try to flatten the top more and then plug my curling iron up, let that heat up for a second. And then I'll come back and try and um, curl it. Okay, you guys, so... I flat iron it more and it's real straight. And I didn't show y'all the length. So the length is in the back. And I honestly can say, I love this wig. Like, I feel like this wig is more for the girlies, the ladies who, the women who don't really know much about lace, don't really care about all that plucking and bleaching knots and all that stuff. This wig is for you. Like, as I'm sitting here looking like this wig is for you. Because all you have to do is just cut the lace. Like, as you saw, I just put the powder in the part and then on the edges and flat iron the top, straighten the hair, and you're ready to go. Like, and you don't have to worry about, you know, plucking your, um, the the front and all that kind of stuff. Because I feel like this hair is, is not, to me, it's not giving, like, wig you know, I think you could still, you know, get with it. And again, like I said, sometimes, and that's with any wig, your foundation definitely matters when you want um, your wigs to be real flat. But for the most part, I feel like my wig is flat enough. I mean, I probably could still do some flattening, um, but I love this. Like I will definitely, definitely wear, I just, I don't really like black hair. But, um, yeah, but it's good. It's good. So, but what I want to do before I go, I want to try to see if it curls. So I'm just going to get the front piece right here. And I'm going to try to see if it curls. And my curling iron is on. I don't know what this thing is on because I don't see. I'm gonna put it on 19. Maybe that way it goes, but I'm just gonna see what it does. As far as curling it, you know, away from your face and see what happens. Let's see if it holds a curl, guys. Let's see if it holds a curl. Hmm. Uh, not really. It'll, if it does, it look like it'll give you that um, like wavy look. And even that's not, you know, too terrible either. But I probably didn't hold it on long enough. So let me hold this for about 20 seconds and see what happens. It probably was longer, but I just wanted to see. Mm, not so much. Because like I said, it'll give you more of that wavy look. And that looks good in itself. So I might go through and try to like just put a little curl in it just so it can have that wave. Yeah, because I like that too. 
I like that little wave we got going on. So, but yeah, it wouldn't, it wouldn't, it looks like it wouldn't hold like a tight curl unless you probably put some type of product on it. I didn't, as clear as you can see, I just pulled it and um, put it on. But, uh, um, wearing it bone straight is fine. So, yeah, that is, that's it. Yeah, that's it. That's it for this video. You know, if you um if you are new here, thank you so much for watching. If you are returning, hey, I appreciate you keep coming back and supporting me. I'm on the road to 5k. But yeah, I really think if if no other wig you will get. But if you know how to work a short one, get that short one, honey. But you want easy, breezy, put on and go, get this wig. Until my next video, you guys have a good one. Well, I ain't having this way. And like the third me go out, take me. What? Go to the drink.